Tom, thank you. Just three days into her reign, the new Miss Arkansas is already hard at work. Dietrich 11's Brooke Buckner sat down with her former A-State classmate, Corey Keller, and gets to hear what she hopes to accomplish this year. Brooke? That's right, Rolly and Faith. Keller spent the last 16 years in the Miss Arkansas organization hoping to turn her dreams into reality, and she did just that on Saturday. The 25-year-old from Stuttgart is eager to represent the natural state. I feel like I'm playing dress up like this is not my reality. This is not my life, but it's not a dream. Nobody needs to pinch me. It is reality and I'm just so overwhelmed with gratitude. Miss Arkansas 2023 Corey Keller has a busy year ahead of her between preparing for Miss America, traveling the state and serving local communities. My community service initiative is feeding the future collaborative solutions to hunger. It started from growing up in Stuttgart in a rural agriculture based community. I was really surprised to find out that food insecurity sat next to me every single day in class. Keller says more than 75% of the students in her school district were on free or reduced price school meals. Well, that inspired me to not only feed the next generation of Arkansas so they can have an equal chance at being successful, but to help my class help my friends and the people I was around every single day. She plans to continue what she's been doing, volunteering at food banks, passing out meals and fundraising, while also advocating on the state and federal level to increase SNAP incentives. We actually just passed a bill here in Arkansas during the last legislative session that any child who's eligible for free or reduced price school meals will now get free school meals. While she tackles these issues head on, she says her family's support is what keeps her going. But on the final night of the competition, she had one of her biggest fans missing from the audience, her dad. He is currently in the ICU at Baptist Health here in Little Rock and from complications from triple bypass surgery. He's been there over two weeks now, but she still made sure to pay him a visit after getting crowned. Hey, Miss Arkansas. It's it's so special and something I'm going to cherish forever. I love the dress there. How's he feeling? <laughs> well, she says he's doing okay. He's still in the hospital, but she hopes to see him released soon. And she's also an advocate for the American Heart Association because she's passionate about fighting heart disease in addition to fighting food insecurity. So as you can see, she has a lot on her plate and she's about to start preparing for the Miss America competition next week. That competition is in January. So I'm excited to see how she represents the natural state. Wow, yeah, very she, impressive. She's yeah. doing a lot of things. It's going to be exciting. We will continue to follow her story.